Hello, Margie. This is James over at Realty Candy. Uh, appreciate you asking about uh, your sold listings. So I want to just share this with you. If you come back here in the back end of the IDX broker login, there's listings, there's off market. This shows all the properties that are either pending or sold that you were the listing agent for. So um, what, what you would want to do with this on status, then you'll just want to click that and you can put sold, pending, contingent. And if there's a sold price, you can put the sold date and the sold price right there. So say this sold for 455, you would update that and put the sold date. And once you do that and you push save changes here, then those properties will start to uh, populate or start to update here. Looks like there's actually a couple of them right here now. And so then um, we would have the ability to now, we, there's another page here, and I'll send this page in my email, where we can sh show sold and pending uh, listings. You can see right here, it uses this, and it shows this information. So you could set this up maybe on your home page, a link to it or something. Hey, here's some properties that we've, we've recently sold. So um, that, that information is available to you. And if you have any questions, if you'd like me to do a video with you, I'd, I'm sorry, if you'd like me to do a screen share with you, I'd be happy to do that. That's basically all um, somebody needs to do is just uh, hop in here and go to this off market page. Just click on the status unknown for each of these properties. The, the tough thing about this is like it says, they'll be removed from your account after 60 days. So I would recommend that once a month, maybe somebody the first Wednesday of the month or the seventh of the month or something, somebody just go through here and click all these and set that status right. And then you'll never have them expire. So please let us know if you have any other questions. We'd be happy to help you out. Thank you.